Welcome to Three Minutes With, where we meet researchers and their precision agriculture projects. Today, we have Christina Ratcliffe from CSIRO. Hello everyone. I'm here to talk about PAT, a set of free and easy to use tools to analyse PA data for any cropping system. This kind of PA data analysis should be routine and our research team and several others have been doing this for years. However, up till now, it's been very difficult for growers and advisors to undertake this kind of analysis because for various reasons, they haven't had access to tools. As you would know, there are many types of PA data and PAD is set up to analyse these. For example, on the go data from yield monitors or soil or canopy sensors, satellite and aerial imagery and paddock boundaries. PAT can also be used to analyse simple strip trials. PAT is a plugin for QGIS, a freeware GIS program. PAT is also available as an open source Python library. It is menu and toolbar driven and comes fully documented with a user manual to guide you through the various different analysis options. PAT contains a core workflow for converting on the go data like EM38 or yields into correctly interpolated maps using well-established protocols. This core workflow encourages a user to correctly clean data and to establish a base grid for all analysis. It also includes tools for many other elements of PA analysis. An example of these tools is for image processing. The tool takes an aerial or satellite image and produces individual canopy indices such as NDVI or PCD, ensuring the result aligns to yield and other maps. The alignment of map layers promotes the ability to define management zones. PAT has a zone creation tool which can cluster map layers such as yield, NDVI, PCD, EM38 and elevation to create zones of similarity. The treatment strip analysis tool enables the, a user to analyse strip trials to determine the effectiveness of treatments within the strip. Uses a moving window t-test to examine variable response along the strip. As with all PAT tools, a full explanation is given in the manual. Just this week we have released a new version of PAT compatible with QGIS 3. It can be found on PAT's GitHub page or in the QGIS plugin manager. Email inquiries to pat at csiro.au are also welcome. If you have any questions regarding Pat, please get in contact with us. Thank you.